Hey guys, what's up? This is Ash. I got a quick video for you guys. I bought me a Christmas present, which is a two terabyte external hard drive. And I just want to show you guys connecting it to the US, uh, to the USB in the back of the PlayStation 5. So you'll see it's a 3.0, um, you know, connection. So it's type A 3.0. Uh, oops, I'm just going to try and see if I can get this in. There, I'm just going to move this down here, put some pressure just to push it in. So let's have a look at the PlayStation 5 to see what's going to happen. So nothing's actually happened on the PlayStation 5. However, if I go to the back, I can see that the light has come on. I can feel the, uh, you know, the hard drive. It's definitely spinning in there. It's a Seagate. As you guys can see, it is connected. It's got some power. So let's just quickly go through the settings, guys, and see what's happening on on the settings menu. Sorry, I'm just having a seat as close as possible so you guys can see what's happening. So we're gonna go over to settings and we're gonna scroll down to storage. And you'll see now, uh, it's still not showing up. All right, let's have a look and find out why. Aha, there we go. So it says, use a USB drive formatted as extended storage and move your games there to free up space in the console storage. Try and focus in there. So it gives me the name of the, uh, of the external hard drive. You can see it's a two terabyte. And it says format has extended storage. So I'm gonna say show. It says you can install PS PS4 games to extend storage and play them directly from there. If you have extended storage drive you're using on PS4, you can also use it. Okay, that's fine. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go format as extended. It says, when you format the USB drive, all data on it will be deleted. Note that save data, screenshots, and video clips will be, can't be saved in extended storage. Are you sure you wanna continue? Yes, this is a brand new uh, external hard drive. So yeah, I wanna continue. So it's currently format as extended storage. And you'll see it's saying formatting, don't disconnect the USB drive. So I'm gonna let this finish and I'm just gonna, oh, it's already done, never mind. Format <laughs> as extended storage. USB drive has been formatted as extended storage. PS4 games and apps will now be installed in extended storage. So it looks like automatically uh, PS4 games and apps are gonna be installed on this external storage device, which is what I want. To change where PS4 games and apps are installed, go to setting storage, extended storage, and then turn on or off. Always install PS4 games to extended storage. To stop using and safely remove your extended storage, go to setting storage and then select safely remove. All right, cool. So sounds like a PC kind of removal process. All right, and there's my two terabyte external hard drive. You see I have 1.84 terabytes available. So that's pretty cool. Uh, and you'll see automatically by default, it says always install PS4 games to extended storage. So now if I had to download any games, right? So I'm gonna move a bit back here, guys. Sorry about that. So now if I had to download any games, it's gonna go straight to the extended storage. So I'm, I've, got a, I've got the PlayStation Plus collection, there's a few games I wanna download. So I'm gonna download that and I'll do another video to show you guys what that looks like from a storage perspective so you guys can see it and hopefully it helps you guys down the line if you are looking to extend your storage for PS4 games. All right guys, with that I'm out and I'll catch you guys in the next one.